an excerpt from Sindbad the Sailor. Here, thought I, was a chance of escaping from the island. Unfolding my turban, I twisted it into a rope and bound one end of it tightly about my waist. Then I approached the great bird cautiously and fastened the other end securely to one of its feet. For thus, when it flew away, it might perchance bear me through the air to some inhabited region. The whole night long I lay awake, but it was not until morning that the bird awoke, and with a loud cry rose from the egg, bearing me aloft. Higher and higher it soared, until I thought it must reach the stars. Then, gradually, in vast circles, it descended, and finally came to earth on a high table land. In great fear lest the bird should discover my presence, I made haste to loose the turban from its foot, and crept away, trembling in every limb. Then, as I watched the bird from a distance, I observed it pick something from the ground and soar away with it clutched in its talons, and saw that it was an enormous serpent twisting and writhing in the grasp of the bird as it flew swiftly towards the sea. And at this strange thing I wondered greatly as I folded my turban. Created using Murph Voices